So guys, welcome back to another video on the channel. I'm absolutely buzzing because as you can see, the video before this is the video of England beating Germany 2-0. So I'm in a great mood. But this video is about Basel's new manager, which did get announced earlier today. Obviously, the disappointing news of Valerian Ismail departing. I did the video on that of how disappointed I was. But he's gone. We move on. We get on with it. We, we've been over this drama before as Barnsley fans. We have finally signed a new manager pretty quick today. The players were back training yesterday and we're starting to manage today. So it's all good. We've been linked with him for a while. His name is Marcus Schopp. Schopp. C-S-C-H-O-P-P. -P. He's from Hart. Hartsburg, I do believe he's pronounced it, Austrian team, which finished mid-table in the Austrian League, but he got them into the Europa League qualifiers last year for a team of how small they are. It's a great achievement. He's played at the likes of um, Salzburg, uh, New York Red Bulls. He's played with uh, Pep Guardiola, Del Piero, them kind of players. He played a lot of years for Austria, actually playing in the France World Cup, whatever year that was, 04 or 94, I'm not sure. But yeah, he's been there, he's done it, he's managing quite a few youth, rank, youth ranks and then obviously he had three years at Harterberg where he did exceptionally well for their squad and their team basically. I'm going to read out what Barnsley put and then give you my thoughts on the new manager which will be seen at Oakwell this season. He's also signed a three year deal, so whether he'll be getting a release clause being bought out end of the year, I'm not too sure. Barnsley FC is delighted to announce the arrival of Marcus Scott to the new first team head coach on a three year deal. The 47 year old enjoyed a successful playing career which included 56 caps for his native Austria and an appearance in the 1998 World Cup, I said the year wrong, alongside two stints with Strum Gaz where he won the Austria Bundesliga in 1999 and Hamburg SV. Scop also lined up alongside Roberto Baggio, not Del Piero, and Pep Guardiola during his spell at Bresica in um, the Italy League. It was within the Red Bull system where the Austrian both finished his playing careers and transitioned into a coaching career. So that was that Red the Red Bull system. And then it also says, having occurred a further nine years of management experience at both Strumgard and St. Polo, two Austrian league teams, um, Scott joins the Reds on the back of a three-year period with Austrian Bundesliga at TSV Hartberg. Scott's Hartberg side defied the odds and achieved their highest ever domestic finish during the 19-20 season, resulting in inclusion to the UEFA Europa League qualifying phase, like I mentioned earlier. A trend evident throughout Scott's coaching career is the development of young emerging talent, a quality that is significant to those at Oakwell, so hopefully you should adapt to the system that we're going for. Commenting on the appointment, co-chairman Paul Conway, so there's no mention from Dane Murphy, he's the usual guy to talk and he's been linked to leaving, so that's not a good sign. Paul Conway said, we are very excited that Marcus has signed with Barnsley and will continue the growth of our football club. He has had a remarkable career as a player and has been phenomenal growing Hartberg in the Austria Bundesliga on a very small budget. I am sure all in the town of Barnsley and have 11,000 seasonal members, which has only just been mentioned there. So 11,000 season tickets have been sold for next year. These vlogs are going to have some amazing atmosphere. 11,000 seasonal members can't wait for the season to start. Scott has wasted no time getting to work, overseeing the traditional pre-season testing programme before instructions with his backroom team. Upon joining the Reds, our new head coach added, it's great to be, come to a country where football is so big, so traditional, especially in South Yorkshire. There are so many clubs and they're so so famous and Barnsley for me is one of those teams. I will help Barnsley get to where they have been in the last year. I will do everything for that. I appreciate this opportunity a lot and I look forward to getting to work, meeting the team and the coaching staff and seeing the sporters back in the stadium soon. There is still time to secure your seat and it says you can still buy a season ticket. Personally, I'm buzzing. We've got a manager. He seems to be following the same route and the same philosophy. Uh, a lot of Bundes um, Austria Bundesliga pages have said he's a similar style manager to um, Ismail. Not as pressing, but similar style. So hopefully we should be seeing similar football. Um, I've seen a lot of rumours saying that he plays 4-2-3-1, so it might be more possession-based and you know, not what we've been used to seeing for the last two years under Struber and Ismail. But he'll come in, he'll work with what he's got. I'm glad that we're signing this early, so he's got a bit of the transfer window, so hopefully he can sign some of his players. Apparently, we've put a left-back in for this um, Dutch left-back. Uh, I forgot his name. 650k from Zwolle. 
which is a mid-table team. He's also played at PSG. So we put in a 650 grand bid for him, apparently. So we'll see if that one comes through. But yeah, we've signed Marcus Schopp on a three-year deal as Barnsley's new head coach. Welcome to World Quell, and I can't wait to see you. First game against Cardiff, unless we get to go to a pre-season game, but we'll see. Let me know your thoughts on the manager in the comments. I'm buzzing about it. Let me know what you think, and I'll see you in the next one.